has signed a 14.2 billion shilling five-year deal with Germany's Gisek Deverent Currency Technologies to print new notes to replace the old ones and also avoid possible stockouts. CPK Governor Kamal Fuge told the National Assembly's Finance and National Planning Committee that GND replaces Britain's Delarue on the job. NTV's Brian George explains. German money printer GSEC and Devrent Currency Technologies, or simply GND, was picked through a classified procurement process amidst risks of stockout of banknotes, which would have had grave economic and security implications for the country. CBK Governor Dr. Kamau Thuge told Parliament Finance and National Planning Committee that the classified procurement process was therefore Again, necessary morning, to avert members. a stockout crisis. The, the procurement was conducted good in morning. accordance with the Public Procurement and Disposal Act and with city. the approval For, of the National uh, Security Council and the Cabinet. Procurement was concluded in accordance with the PPADA and with the approval of the National Security Council and the cabinet. The cost of the banknotes was euros 103,299,000, which is equivalent to 109 million dollars, 422. The notes will bear the signature of Dr. Thuge and Treasury Principal Secretary Dr. Chris Kipto. They will have the year of print as 2024 and will bear new security threads with color changing effects that are specific to each denomination. CBK says the rest of the features remain the same as those of the series issued in 2019. We uh, determined that there was going to be a stock up which was uh, mid-2023. And we knew what the implications of that stockout can be. We also knew that De La Rue on its own, on its own, had decided to shut down its plant. British printer De La Rue, in which the government owns 40% stake, shut down its operations in Kenya in the financial year that ended March 2023 for lack of new orders and spent 15.1 million pounds or just about 2.4 billion Kenya shillings to lay off over 300 workers, pay lawyers and write off its assets. Brian George, Otieno, NTV, Nairobi.